Hey guys, how's it going? My name's Caleb, and I am here today with our third episode of CX3. Uh, today I've decided that we're going to start on a uh, medieval style carpenter shop. So, let's jump right in. Alright. Now I've gone ahead and built ourselves another 16 by 16 uh, area plot in our... I d have decided to actually make this into a full-scale city slash town. So, in what will be our shops district. Now, I understand, obviously, that this is a flat map. Therefore, it has very... Or, actually, has none in uh, the way of terrain. However, uh, I will possibly turn this, actually, into a build map or a build pack rather once I'm done with the city so let's grab our stairs glowstone glass and fences now this is the order of items that I actually use in pretty much every build so yeah alright so I'm gonna start two blocks away from the corner one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Let's see. I'm actually going to delete two off of there. Seven. Um, yeah. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Right? Three, oops, four. Two, three, four. Actually, I have a better idea. So, apologies about that, but I've had a better idea. Alright. So I'm going to go ahead and start over here. I'll go one, two, and here. Two, three, four, five. Oops, actually, I'm doing this all wrong. Three, four, five. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay. Two, three, four, five. That was Mega Pro. Okay. There we go. Now I'm going to actually go ahead and do this. Oops. I'm just going to give it our little outline and actually going to do that right there, I believe. And now the reason I'm skipping these corner blocks is because right there we will place our logs. For some reason the screen is feeling really bright on my eyes. I'm not sure why that is. Okay, and again here and here. And then once more over here. Okay. Then of course let's line or let's create our wooden plank floor. Fill this all in. Okay. Now I'm actually going to see perhaps right there we can do it like that um, hmm. I'm not actually sure how I'm going to do that yet maybe I'll just do something like oops like this we'll see about that I'll leave that for later one two three one, two, three, three, three. Okay, now since it's our cobblestone, I think what we'll actually do, and I did this differently last time, is place our logs down here. It's all the same style, like I did, I used the same style over there, but there's, because it's a mix uh, between my style and uh, as I said, as I gave credit to my friend Brayden uh, last time, 
for the style as well. Um, so it's kind of a mix between both of our styles. So, you know, that counts as well as part of the style. So we can take that out. And in that case, we will get rid of all these, which we so meticulously placed. Not really, but oh well. Okay. And we'll leave that right there. Or we'll actually get rid of that one. I'll see how we're going to do that. Perhaps we will go like that for our door. Okay. Then here and here. Or actually rather we'll go ahead and place full blocks. Alright. So there's our door. Now then we shall do this and here and once more over here. So again, as I was saying, uh there are many different there are several different ways you can actually uh, do the style in, like different techniques you can use. But I'm it's because it's actually a mix of what was that? Two fairly well developed styles. Uh, hopefully, it'll have enough uh, variation that we can make something uh, different beyond just in the actual physical shape of the house. Um, in many of our builds, for instance, how I did the logs on this one versus on the other one, over here, I'll show you, I put these logs up here and did not have this little overhang right here, uh, which I did have on that side. So I, I'm not hating on that house or on that shop. I think it's awesome looking, but this is just different. It's just a different technique. Right. Now, let's see. This is going to be really weird. So we need to go. I suppose I could just do this. And I can't believe I'm already working on the roof. I haven't even built all of this up yet. Okay. Let's, I'm going to use another thing. I'm actually going to take something else from Brayden's style, which I will actually feature him in some of my builds, by the way. You guys are probably wondering, like, I'm stealing all this stuff from his style. Well, yeah, but he'll be featured. Don't worry. Probably, actually, in uh, tomorrow's video. We normally get together on Wednesdays. That's when we've both got a day off from, or when we both have time. Uh, where we both have school, so. Let's see how he does this. A second. Okay, I'm back. Um, oh, I hadn't meant to place that. Let's see. I'm sure I'm doing this totally wrong. I'm not going to bother with that. Because I'm not entirely sure what I'm doing. But. Okay, so I'll just, gonna, I'll just get rid of that. And just make. Oops. Maybe, no, go away. Single pillar right here. Okay. And again. Over here. Alright, now I've had an idea. Oops. And I'll see how it looks. Because I feel like this is just very... Uh, actually, I don't even know how, how to describe that. The lines of motion kind of don't intersect very well. And I'm going to try to fix that. Here. I think I'll just leave it the way it was. I think it's fine. I might experiment with that later on. Not right now, though. 
Replace. Replace. I don't know how I replaced it like that, though. No. Go away. Thank you. Okay. Now, I think this is funny. You guys actually just saw me, like, pause the video and then come right back. I was gone for about 20 minutes. We went on a walk. My family went on a walk. And you guys didn't even know it. I think it's just kind of funny. Okay, now I'm going to do vertical windows. Yeah. Oh. I suppose I'll just fill these in then. Love. I love that song. It is so cool. I like singing. Me and my friend actually. Uh, we're in high school. We got the entire bus to start singing songs. Me and, my, me and uh, me and Nick actually. You guys might know Nick. Hello, Nick. If you're watching this, <laughs> how are you doing today? Okay. Let's continue. I think I need to replace that there. Okay. Whoa, frame rates. Don't do that to me again. Oh, no, 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 no. It's probably because I've been gone for about 20 minutes. It's like, Caleb, what are you doing? You're like telling us that we get to slack off and not do anything. Then you come back and you're like, no, start start doing work. I don't even know what I'm talking about. Okay. Let's focus on building some roof. I'm gonna end up with the same weird problem on the corner as I did on last on the last build. Ugh lag lag lag, lag slash time set day. Pro. Okay. What if I turn smooth lighting on with that? Will you move quicker? Smooth lighting makes everything look amazing. No. Lag. Come on. <laughs> okay. Let's go. Let's let's build, move, come on. FPS. No lag. Okay. No. No, no, no. Okay, you guys didn't see that. I actually had to close and restart Minecraft. It was bugging out for some reason. I don't know. I don't know what the deal is with my computer. Just don't. Okay, so apparently this is actually supposed to be called a carpentry rather than a carpenter's house or whatever it was I was calling it. So I was being silly. Nobody ever says that anymore, like, nobody, nobody uses that word. It's weird. Don't understand why nobody wants to use that word. I don't know. I'm just, I'm just gonna, just gonna build here. Stop worrying about deep philosophical questions. Alright. Let's finish this roof. Oh, okay, so I was thinking, um... Because this is carpentry, out back we're going to have like a saw going, um, which means I actually need to break this. No, go away. Um, and place that there. Okay, now we have a door. Alright. So I was thinking about the saw, how next update with the item frames 
could maybe make this saw. Normally I make it with a sign, um, just because I don't know what else to use, but we could maybe make it with an item frame and then put, like, glass in it or something. Because when you right-click on the item frame, it actually spins the thing around. So we could just, like, spam the right-click button. We could have, like, a, a, a macro that spams right click and makes the saw spin around. Really, are we are we starting on the lag party again? Don't do that. Get back one. Thank you. Okay. Pausing again. Okay. And again. Oh my goodness. <sighs> Alright, you guys are probably not going to be seeing all of the random lagginess. I'll just skip most of this making the roof, because you guys know how to make a roof. It's a roof. But apparently my computer does not like it when I make roofs. So, go away. Just, just enjoys lagging me to death. Okay. We're about done with it though, so it's all good. Oh, I thought there was like some giant wool cube or something in the distance. I was like, did was I like randomly messing around on this world or something? Don't think so. I was confused. No, go away, please. Thank you. Okay. Okay, so now we have our actual building, and we will do this. Alright, you know, I'm just going to pause this. Alright, so I just went ahead and finished the roof off camera. There you go. It's, you know, it's the same basic thing. Um, but, okay, so I'm actually going to make our saw now. So, just do this. Um, okay. Actually, why don't I go ahead and make this out of cobblestone, since we're using this table to cut wood. Okay. Let's put the wood on from over there. And then this. Okay. Now for this, we're going to need a couple signs. Done. And come from over here place it. Done. Okay, now that's our actual saw. I know that's not the greatest kind of saw, but oh well. Okay, so basically it comes from over there, it gets sawed in half, and it, you know. Now, what you could do in Tech It is, if you wanted to put a piston hooked up over here, and then make this saw just a block breaker, and then put like an obsidian pipe or something down here, and it could transport it. And yeah, and then there you there you go. You would have have yourself a cool little uh, carpenting car. Did I just say carpenting? Really? I really just. Oh my gosh! Wow. All right, and then there's this little crafting table that he will craft things out of wood with. Now I'm going to put that there, and then grab. Some chests. Actually, I haven't been putting chests in. Huh. Okay, well, he can have some chests to place items in. Okay. Now, this is actually going to be his house. But what I'm going to do over here is place that right there. 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 That goes there. Another log here. Sideways log, sideways log. I'm going to get rid of these. And, oops. Duh. Okay. Now, from there, I'll go ahead. Is that right? Yeah. Nope. Go away. And, here. No, 
Don't start this again. I just went through a massive struggle with this. Um. Lag. Lag. And yet more lag. Oh my gosh. Mer. Okay, well, we got it done. Oh, goodness. This is really annoying. Alright. So there you go, guys. There's a very laggy, irritating part one. Mm. Mana, mana, mana. Okay, I can actually get in my house now. Alright. So there we go, he can actually, or whoever is selling this can actually step down here. And I think I'm going to need to do. Uh, pause again. This. Okay, back again. Alright, so there's our actual base of our building, um, and we got our backyard done with the actual shop area, um, and we got our actual house with a little shop thing added on where he can, you know, sell his goods, um, crafted goods. I'll just add a door right here. Awesome, we got our main part of our building this way. Alrighty guys, there you go. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in part two. Bye-bye.